So today we're going to show you how to use the side cutout tool. If you already had your fibers running through your ducting, you can use this to protect the fiber. So go ahead and stick it in over your fiber. You're going to want to make a mark where you want your drop off to be. So I've made a mark, mark with a sharpie here. I'm going to go ahead and take my side cutout tool, insert it over the mark. Make sure the tool is centered on your mark because once you start ratcheting the wrench, the blade will start cutting through the duct. Go ahead and tighten down the tool onto the ducting. Pulling it through the ducting, it's going to go ahead and make a cut. Once you've created your cutout, you can use a file to remove the burrs. After you've created your initial cut, you can use the side cutout tool and align it with your initial cut to create an identical cut below. This will be used for 4-inch side drop-offs.